Hey guys, this is, this is your host Rahul from Technoria, and today we are going to talk about Asus eBook X05, which was launched last month here in India. Let's first see what it has got inside the box. Once you unbox it, you will get an Asus eBook X205, a wall charger, and some documents to get started with it. It's a lightweight notebook which is available at less than rupees fifteen thousand, or you can say at less than two hundred dollar. There are some other notebook available at the same price tag like Acer Chromebook. But this notebook comes with Windows 8.1 out of the box which allows you to run your day-to-day -day usage apps on it. Well, at least up to some extent as Acer's eBook is not a powerhouse. It is powered by Intel's Atom Z3735D processor which can easily handle your light, light tasks like web browsing, checking emails, listening music or watching YouTube videos. It can also run your Microsoft Office and Adobe Photoshop but don't put lots of load on it as its CPU is not meant for those heavy tasks at all. As it comes with Intel's Atom Z3735D chipset with 2GB RAM and 32GB internal storage. To cut the cost, Asus has provided limited storage on it and it can be a problem for you. For this, you are left with a couple of options like either to use microSD card slot to expand memory or you can also use Asus cloud storage on which you will get 500 GB of free storage for 2 years. Asus has also tied with Microsoft and you will get 1 TB of free storage on one drive also. It has got a screen of 11.6 inch with a screen resolution of 1366 by 768 pixels. The screen do provide nice screen angles and you can view a screen from extreme angle as well. As, as this notebook runs completely noiseless as it comes with fanless technology which means there are no cooling fans or movable parts inside of it. If you talk about connectivity and ports then on the left side you will find a power port, micro SD card slot, micro HDMI slot and at last you will find your 3.5mm audio jack. At front you will find some LED notification light which notify you in different scenario. On the right side you will have two USB ports which allows you to attach any external drives like, USB, like pen drive or any external hard disk also. At bottom you will have two speakers which are placed at the front side of the belly and you will get nice audio quality out of them. The typing, the, the typing experience on this notebook is very comfortable as it comes with a chiclet keyboard which gives nice typing experience. Keys are nicely placed and well designed which gives nice feedback but they do feel cheap to touch. Asus has provided much room for your palm rest and also provide a huge tripod which gives nice feedback in terms of navigation and sight. Now let's talk about one of the USB of this device. It's a very thin and lightweight device which weighs just below 1 kg and its thin profile allows you to easily carry this device in your bag or a backpack. The entire case of this device is made up of some pl soft plastic which do feel solid but, but the case gets smudges and finger oil very easily which can be seen on it. This is offering this device in many color variants like black, red, blue and gold. There are very less complaints from us for this notebook if you consider its price tag. First we are not happy with its storage scenario as out of the 32GB most of the storage is occupied by OS itself. 
second we are not happy with its finishing which invites your fingerprints but these are not any major drawbacks on it and you can easily live with live with it this could be a good choice for anyone who travels a lot or if you're planning to give a notebook to your kid then it could be a good choice as no other notebook provides so much functionality at this price tag not even a Acer Chromebook before getting it to understand its intel atom processor so that you know what it can do and what it can't so that you don't feel it's a slow laptop once you start using it so that's it from us do let us know what you feel about this notebook and if you like this video then don't forget to press a like button for us and do subscribe to our channel for more videos which are going to come out very soon thanks for watching guys i will i will talk to you in next video